This year's World Food Day celebrations in Western Uganda casts the spotlight on whether farmers, most of them subsistence, can deal with the impact of climate change. Chief Guest President Museveni said it is time members of parliament embrace biotechnology if the country is to be food secure. Ah, you hear they are frustrated. They are there, the scientists. Mm. They are frustrated by the MPs from the villages. <laughs> MPs who need to modernize their thinking. Biotechnology is to impact certain qualities. He also emphasized the need to pay scientists in the country better. We've been training such a large number of scientists. Since the colonial times, I must give some credit to the colonial people. I don't normally give them credit. <laughs> My view is that although we don't have enough money to pay everybody very well, at least let's pay the scientists well. The president's remarks come at a critical time. Climate experts warned late last month parts of the country should prepare for floods and landslides as well as food shortages. A report in June by the Food and Agriculture Organization, the state of food insecurity in the world also paints a different picture. It shows that hunger is a daily problem for at least 10.3 million people in Uganda, today up from 4.2 million people in 1990. The Minister for Agriculture animal industry and fisheries, Tres Buchanayandi, believes that despite the threats posed by climate change, Uganda is food secure. There is provision of high yielding seeds, planting materials and stocking materials uh, to farming households. The Food and Agriculture Organization country representative, Alhaji Jalo, said the organization is working towards helping farmers take up climate change adaptation method. So we have a project, in fact, that deals with adaptation of agriculture to climate change. And that has taken into account several components, from the water for production, to getting alternative uh, income generating activities, to uh, um, alternative activities, to get uh, tolerant species, and everything else that goes with it. Walter Mwesije, NTV.